So we're actually heading back because we're running late. So, unfortunately we have to go. But here's some more. So my, my new goal in life is anytime I go somewhere, just rent a car. Yeah. And just, uh, and just yeah, yeah, just like drive somewhere. It's worth it. There are little places you will never know about. Exactly. You can always know about it. Yes. Like, like when would you say you'll come out here? Yeah. And when is the plan to do the better? What time have a better? It's uh oh, this is like fancy. Uh, this the app? No, I don't know. Let's, no. let's go this way, let's go. Like I was saying. Yeah, yeah, that's what I saw. Like I was saying, you go. Every time I go somewhere, give myself at least two days extra. Just, just to drive around. <laughs> Beautiful Land Rover Defender. Tons of those out here. Barely anything, if any, in the States. Straight or right? Uh, I think we can go straight down because we're not a car. Because we're not a car. <laughs> What's going on? Alright, let's go now. Oh, sorry. There's the church. Sorry. I'm just like looking everywhere. I don't know what to look at. Yeah, we we look like we're lost. I'm here talking into a camera. I mean, whatever. This thing? Yeah. Like every nook and cranny is beautiful. Just amazing. You know what I like? Even the newer buildings, they're like mute, you know? So it doesn't take away from like. Yeah. Exactly. Norman Foster, you can learn a thing or two. Uh, oh, <laughs> yeah, Lord Foster. What's the other one? Stephen Hole, you can learn a thing or two. Um, you guys are great architects, but you don't have to show off every time. Oh, God. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. I feel like we went that way, didn't we? I feel like we could go down there. Oh, you're just asking where we're going? Yeah. Oh, they wanted to go up there just to look at it. The new Theater Royale. Oh, a nice F type over there. Yes, sir. What am I looking at? What am I looking at? Oh, it looks like it's printed on a piece of paper. It, it does, but I think it is actually real. I think it's real. That's bizarre. That's freaky. Yeah, it definitely has... It definitely has relief. So... Why does it look like wallpaper? I don't know. So the argument is, is that texture or that relief there real? Or is it printed and like, like put on? like some sort of fake facade and I believe it's real it's just that bit there Matt do you think it's real or are you, are you convinced? convinced. alright 
And then a beautiful Jaguar F-Type convertible. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Just got somebody on. Ah, oh, Reno, Reno. Oh, yes, that's the glass. Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, not all of them, but some of them. <laughs> no. Perfect summertime car. I think we all just killed our batteries. Yo. We all just killed our batteries. Yeah. My phone went from 85 to 30. <laughs> what? Oh, and I was hoping you were going to use your GPS. Cause I don't got nothing. Plug your hand, yeah. yeah, but it just it doesn't charge. But it runs <laughs> like if you have like a sound, it will maintain, right? Yeah. Watch out. Yeah. Have we been on this street? No. Oh yes, we have. Oh, we walked up. Yeah, this time. is the balcony. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we gotta go. That way. All right. Yeah, that's the. All right, so we're just gonna try to find the car. In some parking lot. Oh, can we go on the right? So I can go into Tesco, get something to drink, and maybe use the restroom. All right. So I'm gonna sign off here. All right, I'm gonna oh, sign off here. Water. And uh, we're just gonna run into Tesco, find the car, get on the road, and go, go to Stonehenge. Stonehenge. Hopefully, well, it's open. We doubt it. But hey, I said Tesco. I didn't say oh, let's just look. Alright, so it is now 7.40, we've been driving for how long now? 13 hours? You should do road with him run. Okay. And we're coming up on Stonehenge and Ingrid's like freaking out. This is out. what we're gonna do. There's gonna be an intersection and you're gonna pull over and there's a dirt road. Oh, it's right here. <laughs> no, it's just right no. there. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. So there it is, if you can see it. That's Stonehenge. Uh, you can't probably even see it on this. It's like a little dot. <laughs> In 400 yards, you will have reached your destination. Your destination is on the right. <laughs> so there's Stonehenge. Bam, there look at that. Oh, that's a good picture if I can there grab that. Ingrid, are you happy? You have reached your destination. All right. <laughs> So there should be a little road over here somewhere they can go left. Come on. Which is probably private road and close, but whatever. Right there, right here, right here, right here, right here. Slow down. Oh yeah, yeah. but you can't get. Yeah, see that's it. That's the big road. That was the road. That was the road. So do we want to spin around and see if we can get any closer over there or no? Look at how slow it's. I don't see anywhere that people can get into. Well, I think we had to turn on that roundabout. Oh, that's good. Go that way. way, yeah. Which is stupid. I don't know why I wouldn't have that right here. Well, it's like that other thing. Like, um, Nick Range. Yeah. There's Wood Hedge. So, are you happy that you saw Stonehenge? Did you take a lot of pictures? Oh yeah. All right. Can we go to London now? Let's go to London. All right, you heard the boss. We're going to London. Catch okay. you later. Good morning. Uh, as you can see, I'm wearing different clothes, but uh, the reason is <clears throat> well, the reason is because we got home late, basically, and I was just too tired and just went to sleep. Uh, I think what I'll do is I'll just explain what happened after, which will probably be the, will probably be the last clip that you saw, which is uh, driving past Stonehenge. Um, 
at that point we were like super behind schedule um and we just we headed straight towards london uh we stopped to eat somewhere and uh, no that's not true we stopped to get gas because we had to return the rental at full um with a full tank uh then continued on to london uh, that was a big mess uh, we we actually decided to stay at a hotel near the airport um, for the first night, so uh, we have to move to the place that we're going to stay for the next few days. Um, so our friend Matt, who was driving and was wearing the white shirt yesterday uh, in the earlier videos, or clips, uh, he he dropped us off. We dropped off our bags, and then we went with him to get food. We found this awesome uh, Indian place, really good. Um, and then it was like a big mess from there to try to like get the car back and stuff. Um, so yeah, it was, it was a pretty big deal. Uh, we ended up getting back here at 1 a.m. Um, at that point we had been awake for 21 hours, uh, after sleeping two hours the night, like previously. So we were shot, so we just went to bed. Um, our friend Matt, who pretty much was in the same boat as, as far as, you know, hours awake and uh, hours slept, he actually, um, he went straight to the place he was going to stay for, you know, the rest of the, uh, his time here in London. And he actually got there like 3 a.m. Because I don't know if the trains weren't running or the tube wasn't running or if it was like off or... Uh, after a certain time, they they don't run anymore, so he had to take the bus all the way into London. So yeah, um, so that's why I'm making this video or this clip now. But I just wanted to sign off. Um, just tell you guys if anyone is in London or visiting London, uh, or uh, yeah, definitely go to Bath. That was awesome. Um, Anyone going from London to Edinburgh or Edinburgh to London, definitely go by the Lake District. Uh, if you want to know exactly like where we went, um, just like let me know and I'll tell you. I'll give you the route that we took if you want. It was just amazing, like absolutely, absolutely amazing. Um, but yeah, so thanks for watching. Uh, we're gonna start the next day's video, which is now Saturday, so it's. So today's Saturday, this is for the Friday video, or the day of Friday, which will go live probably like later Saturday or Sunday. It's confusing. But I'm just going to say bye. Thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. Please like, comment, share, subscribe, everything. Just do it all. Uh, I really appreciate it. All right. So thanks for watching, guys. Bye.